Well, I'm joined today by Helen Schöpman. She's from the uh, European Commission, and she was here to discuss uh, empowering women to innovate through technology, one of the many thematic dialogues going along at uh, WESIS 2015 today. Ms. Schöpman, hello. Hello. Thank you for taking the time to talk to us. Now, um, it's a pretty fascinating field, very broad one, so we'll, be, uh, we'll narrow it down a little bit. But what were the issues that came before the meeting today? What were you talking about? We were talking about different uh, gaps for women to access uh, technology, uh, careers and skills in different ways. Uh, we were talking, for example, about the gaps in, in, in access skills uh, uh, for, um, for a technology uh, career paths, content to, to uh, elaborate content and create content in digital and also to access uh, um, leadership uh, opportunities and entrepreneurship paths for women. And you also had something to uh, offer to that conversation. What is the European Commission doing along those lines? All right. Uh, we do uh, different things. Of course, we have a broad uh, technology agenda as such, but within that we try to fit very, very much the, the women uh, agenda. And one of them is to, to um, encourage uh, girls and, and women to uh, go on a, on a career path for uh, technology, such as so, so learning more about how to code. This is one of the, the um, initiatives we had last year, 2014. There was, we had an EU Code Week that engaged very much young people and also old people in, in learning coding and especially uh, girls and women. And uh, over 125,000 participants were in there and we're going to follow up that this year, 2015, with the, with the whole week as well. And there's actually a link to, um, to Africa here because uh, just before the EU Code Week we will have an African Code Week which will very much focus on, on uh, engaging uh, girls into coding uh, skills and uh, such career paths. It's a, obviously a field with lots of promise, lots of challenges and lots to talk about. Were you able to, in the time that you had together, come up with any kind of plan or call for action? Yes, uh, I, we had been requested to think about this, of course, and, and uh, we, we do uh, we do have uh, uh, action also that we started just recently. Um, because another uh, area that is important that not only that we, we create more people um, that can fill the, the, the skills gap that is actually there for these technology, but also that we encourage the women that are in the field already, that have taken on leadership roles, that have founded companies, startups, and uh, uh, help them to, to lift themselves up, get, get more access to funding, partnerships, and so on. So we want to encourage these women uh, as well. And for that, we have uh, created a, a network uh, with the help of European Union funding. So we call it WeHub, uh, Women's uh, entrepreneur, Web Entrepreneurs Network, uh, uh, where for the moment, it's 25 nodes uh, across Europe of, uh, of uh, uh, locations where women will, will network together and uh, do exactly this, finding partnership, getting access to funding. And that will expand to 250 nodes uh, over the next two years. Well, uh, it sounds like a great program. And we thank you for your time today, Ms. Schoepman. Thank you very much.